shoes, but wait, we gotta do the dance of joy. Okay, guess what, guess what, guess dance what? I don't know, it's something like this. Making it up? I'm making okay. it up as I go along, but that's like a weird version of Jane's Jam, which may be coming back. Oh, Jane's Jam's coming it back. It might be coming back on Friday. I think we just Fridays. had a, I think, I think we just had a sneak peek, a sneak peek of, it. Yeah. of the Jane's Jam. That's, that's, that's makes for good television, well, that does. Well, thanks to what you did this year, that weird dance was deserved because Liam brought in for the first time ever, narrow widths in a thong sandal based on my favorite sandal in the whole wide world. She came out the Bella. I fell in love with her. I bought her and I wanted to get another color. And I innocently on air said to Liam, are we getting these back? No. And he, no, he did He just like cut me off right away. I was like, no. I'm like, okay, don't ask. So that Bella <laughs> is now inspiring the shoe, which is new for the season. It's a gorgeous lizard look. It's all man-made on the upper. It's available in narrow, medium, and wide. The only shoe in the show that comes in narrow, medium, and wide is right here, and it's the first time ever this season that we're bringing you a narrow option in That's the right. classic Bella sandal. And don't forget, everything ships for free. So whether you're waiting for the gorgeous espadrilles that are coming up at the end of the show, which are already popular. You got the Kiki, which is getting limited in lots of colors and sizes. <laughs> now we have the Bella 2 for the first time ever in narrow, medium, and wide, and half sizes. Half sizes as well. And you'll start to see that a lot more in a lot of our uh, sandal styles is that we're going to bring out whole and half sizes as well. So there's no need to size uh, down on these ones. Just stick with your true size, which I think is a really great feature. And great color. So we have yep. black, all black. So, you know, if you have that print jumpsuit from GLE or you've got a great maxi dress that you love and you just want a black thong sandal, a new flip flop as we call it, or a beautiful thong sandal for the season, here she is in narrow, medium and wide. In the purple, it's a beautiful, beautiful purple. If that's your favorite color, again, narrow, medium and wide, but see those gray boxes? I mean, it's only April and this shoe probably won't come back in and be redone. Mm -mm. So get it while we have it. He's saying no over there. And already just this month, over 1,400 have been ordered. We have it in red and maybe a full red shoe is a little overpowering, but this is a gorgeous red thong sandal. And if you're not used to a toe post, they're the softest in the business. And then we have navy. And I always like to put the purple next to the navy so you can see the difference. It's a deep midnight navy. That's a beautiful bright purple. And the bottom makes your brain think that you're walking on a sneaker, but the top lets your heart realize that you're wearing something so beautiful and feminine. I've always thought that the Bow Bella is truly that kind of like feminine, upscale, expensive designer, but those designers don't do it with the custom orthotic footbed. It's just so good. That's right. And look, if we didn't have that little bow detail, um, look, I think it'd just be a nice streamlined flip-flop, but it would just be very, very casual in its nature. This, by having that little bow detail just really helps elevate it. It's still a casual, comfortable style, but if you want to dress this up a little bit more, it's very, very easy to do so. You see the nice thin straps on there, so it's beautiful and streamlined on the foot. But when you put these on, you'll actually be surprised at just how padded these straps are as well. There's a lot of padding uh, on those, so it's going to be really, really comfortable to wear on top of the foot. And you mentioned earlier that soft toe post. So look, if, you, if, you, if you've shied away a little bit from toe posts, give these a go because there's nothing here that's going to uh, aggravate between the toes. Really soft, flexible, like a grow grain material there. Nothing's going to pinch in between the toes. And the beauty with the toe post is because of our strap configuration. The straps sit nice and high up on the foot. So really, you don't, you're not gonna feel the toe post. The toe post no. is only there to keep the upper onto the footbed, not to keep your foot into the shoe. Awesome. So, you know, that's, it's, it's a unique design feature, which most flip-flops should have, but it's really certainly is the case with Bionic. And it's all about what's happening. There, if you don't have Bionic, you do not have this happening inside your sassy, sexy thong sandal. That's right. And you know, I always like to say, if you get home at the end of the day, no matter what your day looked like, if it was you know, chasing after kids or going out with your girlfriends or running errands or whatever it might have been, um, no matter what your day looks like, if you get home and not thinking about your feet, then Vionic have done their job. That's right. what we want you to be, comfortable, but also look great while you're doing it. And right now, maybe it's a little too cool, although it wasn't yesterday to wear your thong sandals outside. No. Wear them around the house. They are the best house shoe. I cannot make my Christmas day turkey without my Vionics on my feet. It's not like you know, when an athlete won't wash his socks and wears yeah. like the same ones all season <laughs> long when he's on a hitting now. street, yeah, right? With household. me, it's like, I, I, one year I was standing there barefoot and I went, wait, I gotta go upstairs. And they're like, why? I'm like, I gotta 
I got all my bionic sandals. These are a classic. Every major designer does them and charges a lot more, but they don't do underneath the foot what bionic does. And look how great that looks on Amanda. You have outfits like this, and I know you have thong sandals, but are they supporting you, cupping your heel, giving you that arch? And not just arch support, but putting you back in alignment, which we're going to see on Miss Amy in a second. I'd love to do colors again, and you can take your little oh, thank you. okay. sad little the comparison sad little sandal We'll have a look at that there. comparison sandal. All um, right. Four quick color updates. We do have this in narrow, medium, and wide, but I'm even noticing red lights popping up a little bit more quickly, which means sold out. So we have this in black with silver grommets. We have it in purple with gold grommets. First time we've ever done narrow, medium, and wide. What a great Mother's Day gift. Honestly, you know your mom's size. She would love to have this comfort. There's the red with the gold, and then we have the navy with the gold. My favorite thong sandal is the Bella Bow, and now she's got a cool new texture and is in narrow, medium, and wide. Free shipping, like everything in the show. So what? this is cool. All different demos throughout the hour, too. That's right, yeah. And uh, what we'll have a look at now is, is a really cool dynamic way to show the difference in, in the, how the foot changes shape when it's in that unsupported position or that overpronated position. What we see is Amy here on a hard, flat tile there, the kitchen tile. You see there's no support underneath there. That foot's rolling over. What I'm going to do is just draw a line where her big toe is and then just use my hand to realign her foot and draw a line where her toes ended up. And there you can see how that foot shortened and it shortened a quarter to a half an inch. When I let it go again, you see how it's elongated and it's getting longer. So a lot of people will say, as I'm getting older, oh, my foot's getting bigger. No, what's actually happening is your foot's getting, um, your foot's just getting flatter. So what we want to do is put some air on the tires. We want to sort of bring that arch back up and that's what this podiatrist design technology is going to do for you. Well, so. I, I'm not good at keeping secrets. <laughs> Coming up next <laughs> is the most gorgeous feminine shoe that's going to be Mother's Day ready, graduation ready, wedding ready, you name it. And don't forget my wedge, which I'm going to be wearing at midnight when Melissa Dawson joins us with the